welcome back to another super rad unboxing if you are new to my channel please make sure you hit that subscribe button and if you are returning then welcome back now i do apologize i know i totally said that i was going to make a new channel for anything sneaker related and that i was going to start posting on that one but i'm still working on an intro for that one so I'm going to post this video on this channel because I really, really want to get this unboxing um, up for you guys. And also, uh, ex excuse my appearance, I just got home from work and I automatically threw my hair up and I got into this like comfy sweater, so don't come for me. Today, we are unboxing the Alternate Grape Jordan 5s that released today, uh, seven, July 8th. They were supposed to release yesterday um but they pushed it back to today the 8th the reason behind that to be honest i'm not too quite sure i heard different things i heard that it was because of shipment delays and then i also heard that because yesterday it was a blackout day so you weren't supposed to spend any money yesterday for blackout day um so the date did get pushed to today now I was super, super sad about this release because it was probably one of the best releases of 2020 and Jordan Brand did me dirty because they only released in men's sizes, so these actually did not release in kids' sizes. So if you are a kid's, um, if you are anything under a kid's 7, you unfortunately cannot get these because 7 is the smallest size that they came out with. Um, and unfortunately i'm a six and a half so i was almost there and i was honestly going to say like i was just gonna get them but i should be realistic i'm not going to wear a size seven so i unfortunately didn't get these but my brother was able to get them in his size so he let me borrow his shoes to do this unboxing for you guys and he was also willing to do an on feet for you guys as well so shout out to my brother coco i just want to unbox this thing but first can we take a second to see how huge this box is like literally look this is the size this is way bigger than my head like look at look at how big this is so for the box uh you get a regular like jordan 5 box um my brother is actually a size where's my brother is actually size 13 which explains why this box is so humongous but you do get that red jump man on the very top of the box uh your size tag nike air um this box came in pretty good condition i know sometimes when you go buy the shoe in store some of their boxes are like really messed up but uh yeah this one looks like it's in pretty good condition just a little messed up there but we usually my brother and i usually don't care about the boxes because we don't have enough room to keep all our boxes so we have to keep them displayed like this so when you first open the box you get this beautiful black paper can we just you guys, I love the smell of a brand new pair of shoes when you first open that. Like, you know when you first open the box and you just, like, you could just get that whiff of newness. Like, oh, I just love that smell. But let's unravel these babies. Oh, my gosh. Look how freaking beautiful they are. So on camera, they are coming up blue, which um, I had seen other reviews. It did look blue. But, you guys, these are not blue. These are legit, like purple like these are purple purple um let me just take them out again my brother is a size 13 so these things are probably going to look huge bam okay they're not they don't look that big on camera but let me get a close-up these are suede like the suede on this is actually really really nice i wonder why they're coming up blue i think it's because of my light it's a white light um but they are coming up blue, but no, you guys, these are purple. You have the hints of teal on, like, the shark teeth. Um, you get the teal on the tongue. The tongue is also 3M. Let's pull out the flash. Let's pull out the flash. Um, you probably can't tell, but it is 3M. And then you got your hint of teal on the lace lock as well. It comes with black laces. It does not come with extra laces. But again, like I said in my Jordan 1 mid-review, um, you can change the laces. I know uh, Jay the sneaker guy 
um, showed these with uh, teal laces and they looked fire. So, um, yeah, you could always change up the laces, but it just came with black laces. You get another hint of teal here. The back, okay, so now the back, uh, you get a Jumpman. It kind of sucks that they didn't put Nike Air on the back. I feel like it would have made the shoe 10 times better. In the tongue inside, you just have Air Jordan. And as for the bottom, you just get your Icy Soul. Um, purple Jumpman right here, I really dig that. The only thing that scares me about Icy Souls is that they yellow so fast. Even if you keep them in the box within like a month, they you will notice the yellowing on these. And yeah, you guys, honestly, overall, super nice shoe. Like I said, in my opinion, probably one of the best releases of 2020. And it makes me just so sad and so heartbroken because us kids missed out on these. Or not kids, I'm actually 23, but um those who wear kid sizes missed out on these and yeah i'm so heartbroken okay guys so that was it for my review on this shoe um super quick super easy i know uh but i really wanted to get this up for you guys super fast i hope you guys enjoyed this video and if you did please make sure to hit that like button because it lets me know that you guys are enjoying these videos so make sure you hit that like button and make sure you subscribe to my channel if you enjoyed this and want to see even more because I have so many videos uh, planned for you guys. So I'm going to stop talking. Um, I'm going to present to you guys my brother. He's going to be doing the on feet for you guys. Um, until next time, I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.